Okay. Here we go. We got me and my my boy on his scooter. He got into a bad crash on his scooter, but he's doing better now, so he's ready to he's ready to ride. Just helped him align his stuff. Looking good. This is the scooter I had before. Woo! This is the scooter I have now. Everybody stops me on this. They stop me on this one too. But now I'm gonna have the wee pad. The wee pad. Ooh. What? Got the red gloves. I gave him everything, man. This dude has everything. Red gloves, everything. And I turned this one red too. I just gotta repaint a lot of this stuff back here. And when I paint it, I gotta paint that and paint some of this stuff down here. Repaint all of it. Other than that, whoo, yeah. Then he's gonna buy this off of me and then I'm gonna buy a freaking Weepin. One of the fastest scooters on earth. All these other scooters that you hear, nah. You get a Weepin, that's the fastest scooter on earth. Those two, that one and the Ryan. They're the two fastest scooters. But guess what? The Wii Pet has so much over the Ryan, of course. I don't know if a lot of people know that, but the Ryan's made from carbon fiber, which is all good. It's flexible, but guess what? A heavier rider can break it. Wii Pet is the other way around. It's like a Tesla built, built to stay on the ground. You literally can stand on your scooter without getting off of it. That's how flat the tire is. And that could be a disadvantage or an advantage because it's hard for you to turn, but it's good for you to you have uh, a good uh, stability. So... Yeah, that's, that's, uh, it's more like this. Ryan is more like this off the ground. And Wee Pet is more like this on the ground. But, of course, a lot different. So, yeah. Can't wait to sell it to my boy. He bought that one. Now he's buying this one. And I'm going to get the fast, one of the fastest sco scooters in the world. <laughs> Anyways, guys. Till next time, peace.